So Ryan, in your LinkedIn, you posted and you said, and I quote you, if you don't know where you are starting from, you will never get to your destination. Can you tell us more about that? And how can job seekers can identify who they are, what their values, and how can they match or apply to jobs that align with their values? Yeah, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of layers to that question. Um, so I posted that because I was getting a lot of questions, and especially I, I do a lot of speaking gigs around the US and around Canada. And when I'm doing a, a delivering a keynote speech, mm -hmm. sometimes the audience, I, I noticed early on that me showing them what, what their goals or how to achieve their goals and the path there is only as valuable. It's only valuable if they understand where they're starting from. Yes. Right. And it, oftentimes people overlook that. They assume they know, but they don't really know. They, they haven't actually taken the time to learn about themselves. What yeah. may, what situations do they shine in? Um, what situations that are, are they not shining in? Yeah. And how to develop the skill set to get to where they want to go. So I, I find that I found that that was something that needed to be said. And I'm sure it's been said before by some Greek philosopher, probably thousands of years ago. But I think it's, it's worth repeating because I, I think a lot of folks nowadays, we live in a very fast paced society. Um, in a world of instant gratification and people see all these overnight millionaires and billionaires and, and things are, you know, a lot of folks, they feel a little bit down on themselves and they think like, oh, how do I get there? Why can't I get, yeah. and I, I feel like I'm here to remind them that how do you get to where your goal is? is you, first, you have to realize where you're starting from and yeah. then you can chart your path. Yeah. And I always tell my clients before we start, you know, have a discovery session in terms of like, what are your values? Can you reach out to five friends and ask them to give you, give you five uh, adjectives that describe you? And then if there's a common theme, it means that that's your personal brand, that's your value that you represent, and you can use them on LinkedIn and you can talk about it. And that's how you can start in kind of an online presence. And if you think about it on a daily basis, having a sticky note on your fridge or on your computer, and you think about it, what am I doing today to make my creativity side better? What am I doing today to make sure that I'm more authentic at work or at home? And that helps. Absolutely. Absolutely. So again, thank you for those great tips. And for the audience, if you have any other tips in how can people can identify their values, please leave them below. And tune in next time for another great question with Ryan.